everyone, Wygo Warrior, aka Julie here, and welcome back to my channel. If you are new, welcome. Wygo stands for when you get old. I am 53 years old and love and enjoy makeup, skincare, doing product reviews, beauty hauls, and unboxing videos. If you have stopped by because you're curious what is in the October 2020 BoxyCharm Base Box, then you're in the right place and keep on watching. All right, I am super excited that my boxy box, as my husband likes to call it, has arrived. I am filming this on, what is today, October the 14th. Um, my boxes are arriving later and later. And, oddly enough, I received five boxes between yesterday and today, two of which are September boxes. Couple companies are behind the times. Anyways, let's get started, dig in, and see what is in my box this month. For those who are new, BoxyCharm is a $25 a month beauty subscription where you receive five full-size products and you get to select one of those products. I selected, I do not recall, because it was well over, uh, what was it, like three weeks ago, and I don't remember, which is a good thing, because now I will be surprised. You also receive a card, which has descriptions and prices of the products. This month, the theme is Candy Shop, and I am iteration 51. All right, let's dig in and take a look at what the first item is. Ooh, it's quite heavy. What is this? Soft Focus Glow Drops by Rodial. Illuminating Ultimate Glow Primer. Oh, it's a primer. Let's see what the card has to say. Illuminate the complexion and achieve a lit from within glow with new Soft Focus Glow Drops. This skincare slash makeup hybrid is a next generation wonder serum formulated with active ingredients to brighten the complexion and give a gentle shimmer to instantly boost luminosity and glow. And it retails for $60? Okay, I, if you've watched my channel, you know how much I love and enjoy skincare. And this is a hybrid skincare. Oh, interesting. I thought it was going to be like the typical um, ones that are kind of champagne-y or bronzy colored, but it's pink. All right, let's do a little test because I am super curious. That's what it looks like. It's like a gel water cream. Oh, it smells lovely. What does that smell like? Like, almost like apricot. Did it make my skin glowy? Um, maybe I'll notice something in editing. I'm not seeing anything firsthand, nor on the camera. But it feels lovely. Okay, on to item number two. This is, let's see, Dose of Colors. I presume this would be a lip product, but let's see before I make a wrong guess. Blendable, lightweight, long wear, full coverage, what? Oh, is this the thing I chose? Is this a... Concealer? It's all coming back to me. Yes. OMG. What does the card have to say? This is the Dose of Colors Meet Your Hue Concealer. This multitasking full coverage concealer has a lightweight, easy to blend formula. It conceals dark under eye circles, blemishes, and other skin imperfections. And the MSRP is $24. I believe I chose this. Ooh, it has a large doe foot. 
That is an excellent color match. Now, it smells like a standard <laughs> concealer. I'm going to blend that in. That is lovely. I got the shade 05 Fair. This box started off really great. All right, next item. What is this? Frank Body Glow Mask. Caffeinated. All right, I'm going to have to read the card on this one. This here is a moisturizing face mask which has ultra hydrating and is natural. It works to reduce puffiness and give the skin extra life, glow, and brightness. It's perfect for pre-makeup, late nights, and morning afters. It's natural, cruelty-free, and only takes five minutes to work. MSRP $21.95. All right, maybe this will be my gateway product because I have never used a face mask or something. I'm, I'm lazy. I don't like putting my hair back. I don't like sitting with goop on my face. So I don't do face masks or um, even the kind that come like in the little foil packs that you just slap. Just ah, something about sitting with something on my face. But this is five minutes, so maybe while my conditioner is going, I could try this in the shower. All right, on to the next item. What is this? Ace Beauty. Oh, it's a lip liner. Please be a shade I can wear. Oh, there's two. Here we have the Ace Beauty Drawed Up Liner Duo, and it retails for $16. What shades are these? We have the shades So Gorgeous and Be Peachy. I'm going to swatch the Be Peachy. Oh, interesting. It's a twist up. That's not twisting up. Oh no! It broke! It's all stuck. I don't know if you can see it. It's in the cap. Really? Why couldn't the red one do that? I'm not going to wear the red one. This is broken. It's stuck in the cap and it's... See how messy it is? sad but boxycharm has really good customer service so when i tell them that i had an issue they will resend me a new one let's see okay so this is what it should have looked like and twist uh, it's kind of cheap the packaging the twist up and down and since uh, i'm just gonna swatch this Ooh. That is bright, but would look lovely on so many of you ladies and gentlemen out there. Just not my taste. All right, that one was a little bit of a uh-uh. On to the last item. I've been saving this one because it's big and heavy. All right, it's a palette of some sort. What is this? Ciate London. The editor palette. Ooh, this is gonna be eyeshadow, contour, blush, all of the above. All right, this is what the packaging looks like. It's plastic. Here are what the shades look like. Six seem to be mattes, and the rest are shimmery of different, like six seem to be extra shimmery. And six seem to be lightly shimmery. So, all right. Oh, and I forgot to mention the price of the Saute London palette is $32. All right, so let's recap. I got a face mask, which may be 
the first product ever of that type that I might try because you only have to put the product on your face for five minutes. Then we got a dose of colors um, concealer, which I'm super excited about. We got some glow drop, which is half makeup, primer, half skincare from Rodeo. Here's to try that out. We got a duo of lip pencils from Ace Beauty and a palette from Ciate London of 18 eyeshadows. All right, I'm going to list on the screen the grand total of this box. Leave me a comment and let me know what did you think of the box. Do you subscribe and did you get better items? Um, did, are you jealous of my box? I'm always curious. With all the iterations, um, it always seems to be the grass is greener where I'll see somebody's unboxing and be like, oh, I wish I got that box. And then others will watch mine and wish they got mine. So it is what it is. All right, thank you so much for stopping by. I really do appreciate it. Don't forget to uh, like the video and leave me a comment. Let me know your thoughts. And if you haven't done so yet, I would love it if you would subscribe. And for those who are subscribed, don't forget to click the bell icon so that you're notified of future videos. Thanks, everyone.